All right, back on the uh, second horse's head. And I'm going to uh, work on his eyes, but I'm not going to show it here. Because I will be covering this, and I do recover. I do cover, <laughs> not recover, this in uh, my instructional videos. Time to play with some clay. Alright, I got the uh, the one eye finished here. And uh, I think it looks pretty good. Now I'll work on the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay. Just putting the cheekbone where it's supposed to go. Okay, I think I'm about ready to put this horse together. I'm just going to do a couple of things more here. All right, now I'm gonna, I've removed the head. It's down here someplace, uh, waiting for me to put it back on the horse up there. I'm gonna make, take this off and the skull and put it away and I'll be right back. All right, I've cut the head off and let me show you. This is the head that I had done before and you can see the size difference is almost a half inch to short. I can't believe I was that stupid. Anyway, I want to see. Okay, I see how I'm going to do it. Uh, I got to be careful. I don't want to deform that which I've formed. Now I'm going to put the uh, wire for the armature of the head into the flame. That's just to heat it up so I can put it in easily into the neck of the horse that I'm going into here. Oh yeah, see that's much better. OK. 
Okay. Ah, like I said, it's embarrassing that I made that big mistake. That's taken me another week to repair it. All right, I'm going to start putting the clay onto his neck. To fill in. That area. A bit of the wire popped through, but that's not going to be a problem. Just cover it. double check on myself here okay I just want to ch double check my measurements here yep right on the button the distance between the point of the shoulders and the top of the head should match the distance between the point of the shoulders and the point of the hip and it does might be off just a little but not enough to make it worthwhile changing everything um, I'm going to set this horse aside but first I'm going to do the ears on one of the horses and I'll be right back all right that's going to be it for now I'm going to set the horses aside I just wanted to get those heads redone and I'm happy with it but I want to <coughs> But I want to get away from the horses for now and uh, start a new project. But I'll start that either tomorrow or the next day. I've got to, I've got an idea of, of uh, doing a warrior standing with a, uh, maybe a war bonnet blowing in the wind and him blowing in the wind. Well, he's not blowing, but the wind is blowing against him. And that's what I'm thinking. But uh, anyway, that's uh, correcting <laughs> the heads on these two horses. I'm so satisfied now with that. But I've still got work to do. But I'm going to set this aside because I am really tired of looking at it right now. And uh, before you go crazy with something, you better set it aside and put it aside and come back to it later. All right. Good night, everybody. See you next time. When we'll be starting a new project. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.